Hello Mofag, my name is Ridwolf and welcome to Mary's Room. And before I say anything else, can I say that I really love this effect? Where you move your mouse around the menu screen and it fades away with all the scribbled things. I, I, this just push, pushes my buttons. Anyway, Mary's game, uh, Mary's Room, Mary's Re game, what am I talking about? Mary's Room is a new game. Uh, it's uh, releasing today, if I got my schedule right. And um, it's uh, a very short experience. Uh, where you explore, as far as I know, uh, in the room of an old friend of yours, Mary, and uh, we'll figure out her story. It's a classic walking simulator, uh, uh, similar to Gone Home and uh, What Remains of Vita Finch, as far as I can tell. As far as I can tell, I can uh, also see some influence on Life is Strange here, uh, as I, from the trailer and the screenshots I've seen, the room looks very similar to the room of Max and Chloe, or rooms of Max and Chloe, and I'm not sure what we're getting in for here, it's gonna be around half an hour, maybe an hour. And I'm actually really excited because this game was made by very few people with very little budget and it's completely free. Um, so I'm not sure what to expect but, I, but I'm excited. So let's just start here and see what happens. Uh, I don't know any of the backstory, I don't actually know the character we are playing. Actually we might be playing as Mary, I'm not quite sure. I didn't want to come back. Okay, why not? Why would I? After all that's happened, even in here. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, here we are. Where is the journal? The journal? What kind of journal are we talking here? I don't want to go back down. Oh damn, I wanted to go back down. Okay, what's this? I'm gonna guess one of these people is Mary. Okay, uh, we can go into the door. Oh, this is- I, I figured the game would only take place in one room, but uh, apparently I was wrong about that. Local wine guide. California crisp white wines. Mm. Delicious. I'll need a crate of those when I get out of here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, picture, let's see. Who is this? Me? Oh my god, the hair. What was I thinking? Is it inappropriate to say women now? Science Fair 2018, second place. So wait, is this taking place in the future or did she actually just won this? Hmm, alright. Uh looks like a Torres. I'm happy he finally got remarried. A honeymoon in the Bahamas. Wish I was there with them. Is that gonna be Mary's dad? Is that what's happening here? Because I don't think this woman is Mary, is it? Hmm, let's see. So I never picture we, we can't interact with this one. Uh, what's this? Oh, hey, look at that! Smart screen. Hundred again today? Glad I don't have to deal with that anymore. All right. Wait, why do you not have to deal with that? Can I open this? No, that's her parents' room. Well, you know, I like to snuggle around a bit. These pictures are changing, so they're more like screens. So this, is, I'm gonna assume this is taking place a bit in the future. Uh, what's about what about this door? Don't need to go in there. That's the bathroom. Well, eventually you have to go to the bathroom. Nothing can avoid that. It's nature. Okay, that looks more like Mary's room. Okay, it looks different from what I expected. It looks a bit empty. Not like what was shown here. Bumblebee. Who that was Bumblebee? A cat? Okay. Uh, she was saying something about the journal. She wouldn't talk to me on the phone, so what else could I do? I drove all the way up there to Vancouver, freezing my ass off in that tin can of a car. <laughs> okay, so we're in Vancouver? Canada? Doesn't really look like Canada outside, especially if it's that hot. Okay, she was talking about a journal. Where can we find that? Ah, oh, that looks like a journal. Mary's journal. Okay. Hey, Kelsey. Yes, I'm talking to you. I know Hi, Kelsey. Yes, I'm talking to you. All right. <laughs> I know you've been reading. Sorry the about that. <laughs> Can I ever forgive you for what you did? Okay. Honestly, I don't know. So we did something horrible, and our name's hard, Kelsey. But I don't know how, because I don't understand any of it. You were my friend, and I loved you unconditionally. Mm -hmm. I did what I did because of you, and I stood up to him because of you. But you, I don't know. Right now, I can't be near you, so I don't want you to come find me. I promise I'll be No, now the room's changing. Right. Oh, okay, I get it. It's Except so weird. she wouldn't be. She would not be alright. Wait, did she 
die or something? Okay, uh... Okay, that looks more like a full... Wow, this actually looks really beautiful. I'm getting some serious Life is Strange vibes right now. Holy shit. Okay, um... Let's see. Orange peels. What? Who leaves orange peels on that? Jesus. So juicy. The drops erupted from underneath the skin like fireworks in the setting sun. Damn, we're getting Mr. Jones's garden had poetic. <laughs> I used to live off his garden vegetables and fruit. Okay. I met Trevor. Okay, Trevor, new character. How old are we anyway? Our, our voice sounds a bit older. I would say like 40, 50. Okay. Music is nice as well. It reminds me of Eric Clapton. Okay, it's 7.13, a phone. Let's That's check that. Trevor's phone number. He called her. Okay. He blamed her for everything. Though she should have blamed him for what he did to her and Mr. Torres. Okay, so Trevor done something as well. Simon Alexa- Wait, isn't Simon Alexander one of the guys who made the- Music? Or did he license that? I'm not quite sure. Is the music license? I hope not. Pillow, I have a dream. All right, Martin Luther King. Me. Don't you ever dream, Kelsey? And I said, I don't. I don't dream. I plan. Okay. What I didn't tell her was that I wouldn't allow anyone to mess with those plans. Okay, harsh. Uh, you know, you kind of have to do both, right? Wake me up when I'm famous. Yeah, that's what I think every single day. Uh, a name badge. Mary Torres. Foot yeah, Rescue Orange it was Grove. A good place to be until Marie showed up. I know she didn't mean anything by it, but the pity in her eyes. Worse than being hungry. Okay. Okay, we can also rotate it. Oh, what's on the back here? Uh, just a clip. Oh, I really like this interaction. This is way more intricate than I thought it would be for a free game. Let's see. Green Eatery. The Green Eatery. Green as in with fungus. <laughs> yes, I am never eating Ayurvedic lasagna ever again. Sounds gross. That oh, oh, damn, I skipped it. God dang it. Can I repeat it? The green eatery. Okay, there, we can. Green as in with fungus. Ugh. Yes. <laughs> the I way she says fungus. <laughs> Ayurvedic it's kind of funny. <laughs> ever again. But some people must have liked Mr. Jones's cooking because he was out every night. Cooking his green stuff. Okay, so that's the. Is it like a like a like a restaurant from from her dad or something? I'm not entirely sure if I get this right. Mix. Holy shit, that is a nice doorman. Not a shadow person. What? Yeah, it took me all I had to convince her she wasn't. A shadow person. What's that mean? But that mixtape doormat. That's that's nice. I like that one. Kelsey's jacket. Okay, wait, my jacket? She asked me why I was so angry all the time. And I told her because... Okay, new it's deal. deal. Mary. It's Russian roulette and utterly unfair. The cards I'd been dealt. Any player would have passed. I chose to be angry instead. Hmm. But Marie? My friend Marie. She got me a new deck. And suggested I deal again. Well, that's sweet. I'm still not entirely sure what their relation was. It was sparkly shoes. I, I read money. socks for a second. I was really See, confused. He bought me things. I was going to wear these to the prom. Fancy, right? A bit overdone, but time, okay. I didn't know where the money came from. <laughs> okay, so he was in some shady business. I'm going to assume drug dealing? Pizza boxes, of course. Uh, looks Marie totally not my, my room. There are actually no pizza was boxes going to there, make right? A new world with them. Whatever that was supposed to be. I've never actually seen her build anything. Out of old pizza boxes? Sounds a bit gross, but okay. Food rescue. I mean, come on. You can't tell me your, this There's game was no not inspired by Life is Strange and waste. What Remains of Vita Finch. I know it. The smell of garbage will be in my nose forever. And the taste of it in my mouth. That's gross. I swore I would never be that hungry again. I didn't care what it took. Okay. But why is my jacket here? I thought this was Mary's room. As the game, you know, suggests. Open drawer. Home Mr. Invaders. Torres and Marie Whoa. were in their own house. Not long after we met at Food Rescue. He was stabbed. Almost died. Damn. She was knocked out with a baseball bat. 
She was in the hospital for a while. Stitches, concussion. She still had headaches, she said. Whoa. Did they ever catch the, the invader? The guy who robbed them? Hmm. Okay, the journal sparkling. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to interact with it yet. I'm gonna still look around. Okay, my backpack here as well. Disgusting, but cheap. I got used to them after I didn't want to go to the food kitchen anymore. The vicious taste of these meatballs still beat the humiliation of being served by Marie. Okay. Weird. In some of these, it seems like she had a very intimate relationship with Mary, and in some, she seems like she hates her. Okay. Vinyls! Nothing? No? Okay, fine. Mm hmm. Fad. Can we turn Sometimes it on? Sometimes it got so hot. This thing wasn't doing it anymore. Then we'd take off to Mr. Jones' swimming pool. Nice. That night, I guess he must have seen us. He must have seen what? That you were in the swimming pool or something else? Alright, let's turn on some Won't Be Found by Simon Alexander. So that's the guy from the poster, right? Sounds nice. I like it. We always dreamed about going to Europe. Okay, what do we have here? Venice, Paris. That's Spain. That's London. And that's is that Amsterdam? And that's Vancouver, I assume? No, that can't be Vancouver. Well, whatever. Do I look like a geography major? <laughs> okay, let's turn on the desk lamp. Yeah, we oh man, look at that lighting. I like it. Okay, what about this notebook? <laughs> la la la. Of course. That movie was a shit piece of crap. <laughs> Glad Trevor snuck us in. I don't think I could have handled these oh, bucks on that. I just I really. <laughs> there. Then again, she always was a dreamer. I bet she loved it. I just re Never realized I didn't want to be her friend in public. I just realized that yesterday I recommended this game to, to that somebody should check out this game to the biggest fan of La La Land that exists. I'm very sorry. <laughs> I must have triggered him to space and back. <laughs> oh god. All right. <laughs> I haven't seen La La Land myself yet. All right, let's check the laptop. Oh, uh Oh, can actually put in the password. She must Is it? Have written it down here oh, I'm not a. Sh okay, uh, let's try shadow person. Hey, there we go. <laughs> a, a gif. All right, let's let's open that. Oh, look, it's a kitty. A little kitty interacting with fishes. Let's check her mails. Why does someone need to get hurt before we step up and act? For Christ's sake, if they had. Uh. None of this shit would have happened, and no one would have died. Wait, Trevor has not broken any school laws, nor has he hurt anyone. Okay, he invited the, the principal, Phillips J, invited Trevor and Mary to the to his office. Oh no! Why didn't Whoa. you tell me, Marie? No wonder you were so frightened. We never should have gone to the Orange Grove. Stalker alert! Shit. Damn. Okay. But gross. Kitties. One day, I just had to know. What's up with all the cats? <laughs> so many cats. She what she sunglasses? Them, that they were who they were without any pretense. That they had no fear of confrontation. She wanted to be more like them. Yeah, cats don't give a fuck. <laughs> Okay, my pet is missing. When Oh, Bumblebee. Bumblebee went missing. Marie. Did Trevor have to do something with days. that? She thought I couldn't hear her at night. I could never prove it, but I'm sure it was Trevor. Okay. Oh, he looks kind of cute. Uh G and K webs. Marie. Whoa. What were you thinking? You know that's illegal. Well, the American dream, isn't it? Jesus Christ, that's a lot of firearms. Okay. Anything else we can do here? Torres Wi-Fi, internet access, 33% charge. And, oh, it's actually 2018. July 7th. So only a few months into the future. Uh, what's this? Okay, we can just leave. Wait, can we actually turn it off? 
Let's try it out. I kind of, I kind of want to explore as much as I can go by. Let's see. Oh, it's just doing the same thing. Oh, too bad. All right. Um, let's see. What else do we have? Oh, little panda trash can. Yeah, pandas are trash. Trevor. Got them trash Trevor mammals. Asshole. After we broke up, he got violent sometimes. Whoa. Okay. One day, he dragged me through the school hall by my shirt until one of Marie's geek friends stopped him. Ben. I think it was. Okay. You got a lot of shit for it later. What kind of shit? As in physical? Yeah, confrontation? Okay. That's a nice picture. Mr. Torres. Thick as thieves. Those I'm two. gonna just assume that Ever Mr. Torres died, is Mary's dad, other. right? Marie was suffering Lorraine. was in intensive care. That was a nasty knife wound. Okay, uh, so Lorraine was probably her mother. That is... She wouldn't stop about time travel and black holes and stuff. I just wanted to do something. <laughs> oh, I see so many references here. Shit. Boring is what she said. Her, a weird kid, talked boring. So yeah, we settled on antimatter because who wants to be boring? True. Antimatter. Okay, fair enough. A ring binder. Oh, there's uh, an book about antimatter. The science project. But antimatter? Of all people, they chose to pair me with the girl from Food Rescue. Outrageous. But I got over it and chose to work my ass off. Okay. I, I still don't get who we get are. Scholarship. Okay, I'm gonna... Are we some sort of, you know, person from a, from a poor family? Oh, Rubik's Cube. <laughs> I actually just modeled one like those in, in modeling class and I actually paid attention to that the... Lineup actually works, so I got my own Rubik's Cube and modeled it after that, so the colors fit. <laughs> I actually do these colors fit. Holds no surprises. Can't tell yet. Love that. Well, I failed my chemistry classes in high school. <laughs> I didn't fail them. I it's the first one I uh, I stopped taking. Okay, have you seen this man? Is that gonna be have Trevor? You seen this man. Trevor. <laughs> yeah. I've seen him. Okay, so it is Trevor. A sheet of paper, what does this say? That's 4th Marie's of March. Birthday. That's weird. I guess she wrote it down for that Ben guy. For her pizza and movie party. Sounds nice. Right, I might have been a little jealous. Yeah! Stop being such a little bitch about it, please. <laughs> okay, oh, Kelsey's phone. Wait, my phone? What is my phone doing here? I thought I was so lucky. An adoring boyfriend. Free burgers from the kitchen he worked in. Sparkly things he bought me. I thought. If so this I is Trevor's him, Instagram page, yeah. Me, and we'd get out just in case I didn't get that scholarship. I had no idea where the money came from. Hmm. That is a glittery phone case, though. Jesus. And I could have just asked him and broke up immediately. <laughs> okay. Uh. Anything else I've missed? A, a stone. Just a stone. I didn't like that she kept the stone. What, what stone? Why did she have to be reminded? I told her I was sorry, but she said it was for me to remind me. What happened? A smoking jar. She hated my cigarettes. Okay, so I'm a smoker. I felt like going out and buying a pack. She made me put the money in that money jar. <laughs> one day that money would pay for our gas to drive to college. We only needed money for the one way. I ended up using it to get to Vancouver. Okay, so we are not in Vancouver. I am still very confused, but I'm starting to piece stuff together. Oh, that's a mirror. That's a nice effect. I like it. Looks like reflection probe? Probably. I don't know. I should stop overanalyzing this and just enjoy it for what it is, I suppose. Uh, anything else? A swimsuit. I loved skinny dipping, but Marie <laughs> insisted on wearing this thing. Oh, really? Jesus. I mean, it was Mr. Jones's pool after dark. No one would ever come close to the freak. And he wasn't there, just to be clear. But someone else was. Wait. Trevor? Really? I, oh, God. Okay, stop overanalyzing. I'll probably put it, uh, put it together as soon as possible. Anything else? Nah, that looks like it's all. Okay, let's try interacting with the journal, which stopped sparkling. Hmm. High school kid saves classmate from hunger. Okay, that's probably my story then, right? Okay. 
Maybe I should put my life story to the type of crazy people here for the last time. Okay, somebody stole her food. They put me on Kelsey's team. My heart races whenever I stop to think about it. Don't think she's all that pleased though. I wonder wherever she remembered me from the food rescue. God, I hope not. Okay, so she did save Kelsey from... Well, from poverty, from, from hunger. Um, and she fell in love with her, but Kelsey came in with a bit of a different thing. Let's see. Can I... Oh yeah, can I can... Go through this. But Jesus, I screwed up, but I was worried. Okay, you offered her my sand uh, her sandwich. Okay. I hope we make the deadline. Just stop. Why do you keep writing this shit? Uh-huh. I can't forget the all, oh, whole awful god. Okay, that's one way we're stabbed. Something my dad was here for trying to stop them. And I would have punched him, scratched his eyes out, I swear. I think I could have killed him. Well, you're one got to me before I. Wait, there were two! They never caught them. Okay, so they weren't there. That was last December. Because they're not afraid to be difficult. We all just matter. Okay. Trying to ignore the fact that uh, all of Kelsey's accuser is paid for with Trevor's money. Such a creep. She says I'm jealous. <laughs> okay, so this is more of her perspective, isn't it? Fuck, I'm so stupid. I finally got to see La La Land. They showed it a classic night. I went with Ben. Kelsey was there too. I was so happy to see her. Actually, freaking hugged her. And she pushed me away. Asked me what I thought I was doing. And then Trevor as well was enjoying the show. And her stupid cheerleader friends. Okay. He's such a fucking asshole. Uh-huh. I'm sorry I'm skimming through these, but I have a schedule to fit. I feel like I missed some stuff as well. Okay. She wears them all the time. Heels duck into my calf, that freaking hurt. Not in the bad, she was amused, I can't think why. To be honest, I wish I was size 9 because they look absolutely gorgeous on Kelsey's feet at least. Trying on mommy's shoes. I have a dream. See, Martin Luther King. There you go. Less and less F words in these pages. I'm so freaking po The fucking swear. Okay, that's a direct reference. Just, not that I mind, but that's a direct reference. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Are we still missing something over here? Like all the time. So, friend. I told her to deal again, not drugs, but cards. Kelsey broke up with Trevor. He lit, but he literally tore her clothes from her body. Things can only go better from now. I think he's crazy. He keeps calling me at the most impossible hours just to yell at me. I now unplug the phone when I go to sleep. Whoa. Wait, that that's it? I missed some stuff? Oh wait, no, I clicked back. I'm just dumb. <laughs> Today was a good day. Only five emails from- Wow. Wow. He slid his finger across his throat. Kelsey took me swimming. I was scared shitless the first time I'd ah, two beers and freshly picked oranges. Chill, best nights ever. Whoa, what the fuck is this? They're not listening. I tried every authority as well. I tried, even tried the cops, but they just patted my, patted my shoulder. Poor little girl, still traumatized. Whoa. Jar full of candy. <laughs> I wish I could tell Kelsey, but she'd go and say and get herself hurt, or worse, go back to him. Trevor's danger. So, so Trevor did something. I know it's him. There's nothing I can do. They never believe me. I don't think I was. So Trevor most likely kidnapped Bumblebee or killed him. Or killed her. I'm not sure if Bumblebee's a girl or guy, cat. I'll have to be fearless. I found this way you can buy guns. It's for protection. Okay. Another home invasion just two blocks from here. They killed the woman this time. The police think it's Trevor. Suppose it was him in our house? I can't wrap my head around it. It's too big, but Kelsey says it isn't true. 
that Trevor is the best and would never commit such violent acts. I wouldn't be so sure, man. Looking at the torn shirt, I think I might. she might be in denial. I think so as well. We need this. Beer, water and oranges. Like so many nights before Trevor. No, I'm not going to let him spoil my nights at the pool with Kelsey. He who shall not be named shall not be named. Not today. Okay, we're still missing some pages. Uh, I must have missed something around here. Oh, there's a bike basket up here. Let's see. That's probably uh, related Trevor to the skinny dipping. <laughs> when Marie and I rode our bikes through dark nights just to get a taste of those perfect oranges, I knew he was lurking in the shadows. Jesus Christ, what a creep. I never told her, but I think that's how he found us. He followed us back to the room. Wait, what room? Like the, like the college room? Or are we talking this room? Okay, paper tissues. Uh-huh. Oh, the drawer. We can open that. Lorraine. Marie's Marie mom, Curie. Died when she was five. My oh, that's sweet. She might as well have been dead. She looked more dead than alive, anyhow. Passed out on the couch, empty bottles of gin on the floor. Whoa. God damn. That's depressing. I can actually kind of relate to this because my... Uh, the, the person my, my mother most admires is Marie Curie. So that that's uh, relevant. <laughs> Okay, we checked out all of this. Lost home. Start running. Okay. Let's see. Beer bottle. Mr. California Jones summer beer. beer. After the robbery, he only had a couple left. Apparently they were hard to come by. Still, we decided to try a bottle once. Marie loved that label. She drew it in her journal. Okay, it's probably gonna be in the journal now. All that happened later that night, I'm not sure. Maybe I don't want to remember. Hmm. Okay. Fair enough. Journal is updated again. Uh, I think that's all now. I'm actually gonna check the journal again. Let's see. Oh, goddamn! I clicked back again. I'm. Wait. It's still not there. Maybe I. There's now. To ride a bike because it ain't cool, our rides are the best part of the day now. On the day we rode from Mrs. Orange, Orange Grove, Mr. Jones Orange Grove, in broad daylight. We got home with a basket full of the juiciest golden orange. I didn't even think about getting caught. Okay, so they were stealing the oranges. Uh huh. Okay. That's all the same. Don't think a lot has changed. Oh wait, this is new. Happy birthday, Mom. Aww. How cute. Okay, that's uh, all the same. So I'm still missing something. Not that I mind, I actually really enjoy this. What's this? Shopping bags. She loved being a birthday girl. Mr. Torres would take her shopping every year. Okay. So, wait, is that the same? She loved yeah, it's being the same bag. Girl. Mr. Torres would take her shopping every year. Hmm. Take out. Okay, I can go for Every Tuesday, tamales. Every trucks would roll in. Me and Marie never missed Jorge's tamales. When I was a kid, Jorge would put them aside, just in case my mom was too drunk to feed me again. Whoa. Did both of our moms have an alcohol problem? Or was she talking about her mom? I didn't really pay attention there. I maybe should have. That's my jacket. We've looked at that. Shoes. Pizza boxes. A shirt, record, calendar. Wait, what's this? Can't pick this up. Candles. The developers really paid attention to how where they play stuff, and I really enjoyed it. it. Looks very. How do I put this? Um, real, authentic. Oh, then again, authentic to what? But I, I you get my point. Crosswords. Hmm. Also, I'm surprised the game runs really well. I'm having it the best side of things. It looks fine. And um, for uh, oh wait, broken window. Wait, that's probably She's where the stone came from, right? I had to tell her, so I came back here throwing stones at the window, but she didn't react. Oh my I threw god! A bigger stone, and it shattered the glass. <laughs> she kept the stone as a souvenir to remind her not to trust me. Ever wow! Again. That's just mean. Damn. <laughs> Okay, but that didn't update the journal, did it? Uh, we took a look at the notebook, right? Yeah, that's the La La Land thing. Hmm. Kind 
can I also say the music is simplistic, but I really enjoy it. It fits the scenery. I'm just gushing all over this game, aren't I? <laughs> well, if it's good, I can do that. Um, but I'm still missing something here. Oh, case. There we go. I need oh. to find the key. A five-figure number. Maybe it's in the journal? Journal was updated just now. Let's see. Five-figure number... 21418 could be the one. Um, wait, there's still something missing over here, most likely. Uh, I'm gonna try 21418. I need to find the key. Not 14. The five figure number. Nope, that did not do it. Wait, what did that? She said something. Same. Uh, okay, so we need a five-figure number. Where would I? Where can I find a five-figure number? Maybe on the on the laptop. Maybe the age of the cat or something. Uh, shadow person. God oh, damn. damn. What's the password again? Yeah, 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 yeah. Just, just shut up for a second. There we go. Uh, maybe in her mails. Why does someone need to get her? No. No, oh, no, 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 not what I wanted. Tell me, Marie? No, one day, no cats. I, when Bumblebee. It's probably not missing. gonna be the missing one, but that can't be right. Marie, what no, you that can't be right. You know that's illegal. Of course she knows. Um, five figure number. I've either missed it already, and I'm a just big uh, idiot, but. Uh, let me think, let me think, let me think. Um, yeah, of course, the bike helmet. Let's, let's go with that. I couldn't afford a car, and Marie didn't want one. So we rode our bikes everywhere. Well, we figured that much already. I thought I looked silly. And with those damn sparkly shoes, I probably did. Yeah. yeah. Shoe, you were wearing, wearing those shoes on a bike? status at school, right there. Alright, uh, that updated the journal. Let's see. I did it, I hope I'm not going to regret this. Wait, the lock? Is that the... Is that the lock in front of the... Uh, uh, the case? Uh, where's the bike thing? Hold on. I feel out of place everywhere outside of my room. She said she was sorry, I know, but fuck, I feel like walking on eggshells and it's not adventure to be, right? Feel disconnected. She did not want to be my friend. She was embarrassed. Fuck, fuck, fuck. <laughs> okay. Um, but I still don't see a five number combination. Hmm. Okay. Still missing something here. Wait, this. Wait, wait, oh, I see it. Three, four, nine, five, one. Three, four, five, nine, one. What is the code, Marie? Wait, the journal. It must be in the journal. Of course it is. She must have written it down here. So Did I get it wrong? Let's, let me, let me see again. Three, four, nine, five, one. I'm an idiot. What is the code? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got it. Don't, don't you worry it's about it. The jerk. Yay. Okay. Good work, Kelsey. Oh. Oh my God. Fuck. So this is where she hit it, huh? The past, like the future, is indefinite and exists only as a spectrum of possibilities. Did you actually use it? Stephen Hawking said that. I wish it were true. Rest but in peace, Mr. Hawking. nothing I could do about the past. It was definite as hell. 
Whoa, Sometimes what's this? I didn't get Marie. I really thought a night by Jones's pool would help her relax. She used to love it there. But she insisted someone had been watching us. I just wanted to have a good time, and she was ruining it. So I said some things I shouldn't have. She just stood there, staring at the window. I was so annoyed. And that's when I knew she'd been right. Trevor. Right there in the room. He'd just come in through the open window. How did he find us? He didn't know where Marie and I lived. I always made sure of that. Oh. He took an orange from his backpack and started peeling it. What a fucking creep. Trevor by the pool. And he'd followed us home. He said to Marie, I told you not to mess with me. But still, I didn't get it. No, it wasn't until he started moving in on her that I realized it was Marie. He was after Marie. He blamed her for everything, and he had a knife. I'd never seen him so angry, so evil. Marie tried to get it away from him. He asked her why she never answered her phone. Did she not read her emails? Or did she think they were hollow threats? God, I just wanted to punch him with anything I could lay my hands on. My backpack. What was smashed it? it against his wrist, knocking the knife out of his hands. Marie and then? went for it, but Trevor was faster. He kicked her in the head. Oh, damn. He dove for the knife, but he jumped me. As we struggled, he hissed. Didn't I get enough action yet? Maybe I needed another baseball bat to get my kicks. I stopped, because right then I knew what he was up to. He asked Marie about Mr. Torres. Was he all right? Did he still get stomach aches? Marie lay on the floor by the bed, in shock, realizing it had been yeah, Trevor I, who almost killed her father. I guess that was kind of obvious. Me, added with a smile. And her. That's when it all went to pieces. Trevor ripped us apart, and he was enjoying it. Holy shit. Marie didn't understand. I tried to explain, apologized, but she wasn't listening. She kept asking me if I'd been there with Trevor in their house. Trevor stirred things up even more. He told her it was me who had hit her over the head with a baseball bat, that I'd enjoyed it. I screamed in frustration, no, that's not what happened. Tears streamed down Marie's face. She couldn't believe I would do that, hurt her deliberately. God, I wanted Trevor to stop talking. I attacked him, scratched his face, hit him wherever I could. I hated him, he was twisting everything. I wanted to tell her that I was sorry. Yes, we robbed the house, and we got caught by Mr. Torres, but I never meant for anyone to get hurt. I didn't smash Marie's head. I panicked. I wanted to stop her from seeing me. When I realized how badly injured she was, I called the police. I tried to stay. Trevor wouldn't let me. He pulled me by my hair into the van. But Marie wasn't listening. I was losing it, and I like to think I beat Trevor up pretty good. But Trevor punched back harder and faster. He was about to crack my skull. Marie clawed for the box beside her, opened it. She screamed, told us to stop, pointed that 9 millimeter at us. Trevor went nuts, charged for her. She screamed, told him to stay back. She'd never shot a gun in her life. She wasn't going to start now. Trevor grabbed her by the shoulders and I What do you think you remember is not necessarily what really happened or how others remember it. But Trevor fell back on the carpet, dead. That we all remember. the fuck? Mom, where are you? Did you get the journal? I'll be down in a minute. Anne Marie is getting a little worked up here. She threatened to smoke a cigar in your car. Wait, we're with Marie? Don't let her smoke. I love that car. She knows you do. Get down here, Mom. You're taking like forever. Okay, so down. it is far in the future. Okay, we're supposed to bring the journal. 
wait, we can now probably read the last part. I regret food rescue, I regret the science project. Someone died right in this room. I made him die. I'm leaving this journal here. Fresh pages. I'll send for you someday. And this is a message to Kelsey, huh? This is Devon by the by the pool. Are we with her right now? Did we actually get back together? Damn. Good job, man. Good fucking job. Okay, I, I need a minute. <laughs> yes, yeah, Simon Alexander, so it was licensed. I hope it's copyright free. <laughs> Jesus. Um, okay, yeah, thank you for thank for thank you for making this game. That was way better than I expected. I expected a lot even. That was amazing. The plot, the, you know, that the the gameplay was, of course, very simplistic. Very, very much. It, it reminded me most of all of Gone Home, um, which is not my favorite game in the world. It's still a good game. Don't get me wrong, but it has some flaws. But I think this game made the right decision by limiting itself to a very confined space, just one or one and a half rooms. And the twist at the end, that really caught me off guard. I didn't even think about that, that that was the possibility. Because I was trying to piece the story together as accurately as I could. That was good. Big props to the developers. The voice actors and the designers and all of it. You did an excellent job. And uh, as I said at the beginning, this game's free. The links in the description if you want to check it out yourself if you want to see if i maybe missed something i don't know if there's anything else or if you just want the experience for yourself then please make sure to go into the description go to steam download it give it a play yourself if you enjoy these kinds of games it's well worth your time hell i would have paid money for this if i knew it would be this good excellent job that's all i have to say i hope uh, the development team continues with making games I would love to play more of them. That was really good. Uh, please make sure to leave a nice review. They could use it. It's a small development team, their first game. So, make sure to do that. I'll make sure to do that as well. Also, thank you very much to the developer. He gave me an early copy of this so I can get it done by today. That's all. I really enjoyed this. So, if you enjoyed Mary's Room, or the content of this channel in general, then please make sure to like and subscribe, that would be very helpful. If you want to support me what I'm doing, you can click the button right over there to go to my Patreon page where you can support me. I would really appreciate that. And otherwise, until the next video, I am out.